Hello and welcome to the Intuitive Message, your channel they call me, Mitchell, and this is your energy forecast and intuitive message for today, Wednesday, January 27th, 2016. As always, thank you for taking time to watch, retweet, post, subscribe, become a fan, support me on Patreon.com, and check out my website at IntuitiveMitchell.com. So today your message is this. I've said it before in different ways, and that is, listen, allow your spiritual parents on the other side of the veil to help you as needed. You just have to ask for help. You know, so many of us in the real world don't want to ask for help from people. And then we translate that into asking our angels, our guides, you know, those who've crossed over, you know, our spiritual parents, you know, those are kind of watching over us, those who kind of guided us along our, our way and, and helped, you know, bring us into adulthood. So the bottom line here is just ask, just, whether you reach out to angels, you know, whether you call them loved ones on the other side, whatever, you know, however it works for you, however your mind can conceive and work through it best, just go with it. Go with it. Don't worry about, you know, sometimes you just say, you know, right, anybody on the other side that is of high vibration, I ask for your assistance now in this or that or this or that. So there's your message for today. Let's look at some cards and some numbers. So today is the 27th day. All the numbers add up to number one. So today is a one day. Dynamic, masculine, beginnings, starts, you know, independence. It's a kind of a leadership kind of a quality and day. And then the norm to go along with this one energy day is the woman. So this is about you if you are a woman. If you're not a woman, it may be about another woman in your life. If you are a woman, this still could be about another woman in your life. But most likely, if you're a woman, it's about you. Tarot to go along with this woman is going to be six of coins. So this is, the six of coins is usually about bringing things back into balance. As you see the hand dropping the coin back in. And the balance usually comes in and around money, resources, finances, your home, your abilities, your talents, things like that. So the home may be coming back into balance, relationship, very earthy ones. Um, uh, finances, that's usually the biggest one. But it's just about bringing things back into balance. Also, it can be about being generous as well and giving to bring things back into balance. You know, offering the hand to someone else to help them find balance in their life. So, you know, again, one energy day, dynamic leadership. So this may be a point where you as a woman take a little bit of control and step into a place of leadership and offer that balance. Um, or reach out very dynamically and say, I need help from somebody. So tomorrow is the 28th day of the month, and that is a number two day, just pretty much kind of the opposite. It's very receptive. It's very feminine, cooperative, unity, harmony, relationship. Um, and the Lenormand to go along with that is the clouds, number six. So number six, or the clouds card, is often about not really being able to see clearly. It's like looking into a mirror that's got steam on it. You can't really see your face, so it's hard to tell what you look like, or if you're going to put your contacts in, or take care of a zit. You know, it's difficult. Or just driving down a road, it's difficult to navigate, maneuver, and work through that. Some other key things, problematic events, uncertainty. That's it. Doubts and confusions. Because when you can't see clearly, you usually doubt what's ahead of you. And then terror to go along with that is tower. So, tomorrow, it really feels like it's a day that I would say be very careful because the tower is often about destruction, un un unraveling, you know, marriage, you know, it's about like divorce and falling apart, losing the job because the tower collapses. So whatever you've built probably is going to be unraveled. I love to look at it as um, like you have a garden and it's harvest time and you're done. Now you have to till the garden. You have to rip out everything you planted because it's going to be a new season. So you may have confusion around the unraveling, or you may not see clearly, and there may be confusion, which in return, because you were not clear and you were confused, you brought about the unraveling, the collapse, the disruption of, and the tower falls down. So I would say with the two energy tomorrow, be very feminine, very receptive, um, and just kind of navigate and maneuver yourself very carefully. Um, you know, baby steps, one step at a time, and watch out for knocking the tower down. But also, you may just, the tower may collapse, and you may be just, oh my God, I'm so confused. I don't know what just happened. So then I would say just again, be patient, um, be receptive, and see where it takes you. So there's your message. So a couple things. Um, next Tuesday night, The Gab on the Wellness Universe. Sherry, Elise, and I are going to be doing our every other week um, visual show. I've done radio, blog talk radio for a long time, but now it's going to be visual. So 
go find my webinars, link to it, find it, click on it on intuitivemitchell.com and sign up for it um, so, you can, so you can view it or listen to it. Um, there's a chat room. We're just going to have a blast. She and I are putting the finishing touches on kind of how we're going to operate. So it'll be fun. And then I'm at VCOS Expo in Orlando, uh, February 6th and 7th, all on my website, Intuitive Mitchell. You can click on that and find out what's going on there. Purchase a session, get a free ticket, and um, the Ghetto Tarot Spread. So this Saturday, I've been offering the Ghetto Tarot Spread, a six-card spread about revealing your shadow side. And that was delivered back to you in a YouTube video. Now I'm kind of bumping it up a little bit, and if you want a quick 15-minute, you know, in-person, you know, reveal your shadow side, the price is a little bit more because it's in-person, and then the dedicated time is only this Saturday in the morning um, up until about 2.30. All that on my website, intuitivemitchell.com. Talk to you tomorrow. Namaste. Bye-bye.